Okay. Users. Users? Yowzers. Well, these guys are users too. Welcome back, everybody, to Fallout on the Tale of Two Wastelands Overhaul with the Capital Punishment Mod List. I'm the Bearded OG, and I uh, I have actually taken a break from this game for a few weeks. Well, probably for about two weeks. Um, you guys, of, of course, would have no idea that I had done that if I had not said anything to you because I got so far ahead <laughs> in the episodes that um, I decided to to wait until we got caught back up again. And so I've been playing a lot of uh, Satisfactory uh, in the meantime, uh, because that game, by the way, is coming out um, for in full access or full release here in about a month. So I've been trying to, you know, kind of fast track my current series to get ready for the new one. Anyway, that's neither here nor there. Um, the only reason I'm even saying that at all is because I may seem a little bit out of sorts about certain things because I my head hasn't been in this game. And you you might take an episode or two to get back into it. Um, now, what I wanted to, what I do remember doing, and I want to show you is that I've um, I got a few uh, new weapons. Uh, first of all, I purchased from my caravan vendor over there um, a a fifty millimeter sniper rifle. Uh, anti-material rifle so we have this now um, the reason I'm not taking it with me at the moment though sucker weighs 20 pounds for one thing but um, I don't really have any ammo for this I got a, a few rounds for it but not much but it does uh, it does 262 damage per single shot um, and so that, you know, that sucker packs a punch. So, you know, we'll be on the lookout for 50 millimeter ammo. We'll probably buy it. Um, I have, like I said, I have just a few rounds here. I have seven rounds and nine incendiary rounds. So we'll wait until, you know, our uh, supply of ammunition for this weapon builds up before we start using it. Um, however, I also purchased from... Um, the, you know, the military bot that's, where the hell is that place at again? Seneca Station, right. Uh, the, you know, that vendor at Seneca Station, that military bot, I purchased from him um, this bullpup sniper rifle. And it's it's better than our, you know, the current sniff, uh, sniper rifle that we've been using. It packs a little bit more of a punch. I like the scope on it a lot better. Um, you know, than that other rifle. And if you're curious, this is what it looks like. The lighting's not super good in here, but it's a pretty badass looking weapon. So we're going to start using this uh, for our sniper rifle. And I put the other sniper rifle in, into storage. It also uh, shoots 308 rounds just like the other one did. And then finally, I also purchased this infiltrator from um, uh, the, the caravan vendors. And it uses 5.56s, and it's got a built-in uh, silencer. So this is going to take the place, for now anyways, of our pistol for mid to close range uh, engagements. And, we'll, you know, I'm just mixing it up a little bit because I've been using the same weapons a lot. Not, not that that's a bad thing from the standpoint of, you know, they're the best weapons I have, but I just want to, like I said, mix things up a little bit. All right, so other than that, I don't think anything else has happened uh, since the last episode, I just made my way home, you know, got fixed up and all that and bought these weapons. So what I would like to do is I would like to go to the, um, back to the regulator headquarters to turn in, uh, our contract. And then I think I want to go ahead and do the Nuka Cola challenge and go to the Nuka Cola factory next. Cause I'm, I, I just, I don't know. That sounds like fun. And then we can finish that. <clears throat> and then after that, we're going to kind of have to just 
figure out priorities here. Um, and probably what we'll do is we'll, we'll get back on the main quest. I'm thinking, and then just kind of go from there. I, I am kind of feeling like, uh, I don't want to spend a ton more time in, uh, in the wasteland capital wasteland. I do want to get to new Vegas fairly soon. That doesn't mean we're going to go there tomorrow, of course. Um, and we can always come back here too. So it's not like once we go to Vegas, it's over here either. So there, there is that to consider as well. Okay. Well, anyway, uh, let's go ahead then and mark the regulator contract as our active. And I'm just going to run up there to turn that in. And then we'll come back to the base here because it'll be on the way down to the nuclear coal factory. We'll pick up all of our current Nuka-Cola Quantums and then head down there. So I'll just see you up at the headquarters for the turn-in. And as usual, if anything crazy happens along the way, I'll show it. So let's do it. Man, some firepower going on over here. Got a dead brotherhood. Some bandits. Somebody got disintegrated there. That brotherhood's still standing. I thought there was... That gunfire was coming from inside of the... Oh my god, all those cars are on fire. Are they gonna, like, go nuke? <laughs> oh, this... This was the, uh, the traveling guy. I can search him? No. Help our brotherhood, buddy. A scout rifle. Hmm. We need a, a hunting rifle for for Bob. That's a scout rifle. It's a five five six. Oh. That looks like a sniper rifle. Interesting. Got a poly stock. Um, what's it worth? It's worth not a whole lot. We'll hang on to it though for now and get rid of it if we need to later. There's two dead brotherhood. We'll take that. Um, I'm not going to take any of his armor because we already have full sets of brotherhood armor back at the base and it's just heavy as shit. We'll take a look at that laser rifle in terms of its value. Yeah, that one's got a 41 V dub. Um, can I use the other one to repair it? Yes, I can. All right, now it's got a 68. That's really good. Okay, cool. All right. Did we check this? Yes, we did. Oh, another dead brotherhood. Doesn't have a weapon, huh? All right, let's proceed. Yeah. 
You live the life of a regulator. You're an example to... The unrighteous will fall. Let me see... Take all of them. You've done good work. Not a... Good deeds... I've gained karma. Regulate. 310 caps. Nice. Regulate. All right, now, collect the bounty from here. Um... Oh, do I have to... Right, select reward ammo. Um, I still think we're going to go with 308s. And then back and go to log off session. We got 150 more caps and we should have 308s in here, which we do. Excuse me. All right, let's take the next one. One contract. Uh, wait, I have an existing wanted contract. How do I have an existing contract? I just turned it in. All right, what if we reset it? I hope this isn't the one that's all the way up to the extreme north of the map where that talking tree guy was. I think it is, though. Shit. I don't want to go back up there. Yep. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, man. Well, all right. If we do end up going all the way back up there, I'm going to use a, a gopher uh, or a mole hole. I'm not walking all the way back up there. Hell no. Okay. You should talk to Sonora. I just did. Okay, let's just take the mole hole back home. Uh, we're going to go to Megaton. And uh, I'm going to grab all the Nuka Cola Quantums that I have, and then we're going to head to... Whoa. A little stuttering there. We're going to head to uh, the Nuka Cola Factory, which is all the way to the extreme south. And it'll also be new territory that we haven't been to yet so that should be fun all right let's grab all of our quantums here we want to put oh, i guess we didn't grab that okay so i have 27 in total i think we needed 30 right pretty sure it was 30 that that quest wants. Uh, data. Quest. New cola. Yeah, 30 bottles. Okay. And location is all the way here to the south at the Nuka Cola plant. So once we kind of get a little past the start of the city, then that will all be new territory for us. Uh, I don't think there's anything else we need to do here, so let's go. Let's do this. How am I doing on food and water and all that kind of stuff? We're a little bit thirsty, a little bit hungry, a little bit sleepy. No radiation. Yeah, we're in pretty good shape. I must have fixed myself up. Uh, we do have some limb damage, though. All right, let's stop in, off in Megaton at our first aid station and get that fixed. So that way we're in tip-top condition. Hey, I Wadsworth. Are going well with you today, sir. Good morning, sir. Good morning. What can I do? How about a joke? Two atoms are in a bar. One says, I think I lost an electron. The other says, are you sure? To which the other replies, I'm positive. Right. Hey, do you, you got any water? Certainly, sir. Here you Thank you. Certainly, sir. Here you are. 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 Thank you. 
I'm sorry, sir. My... <laughs> okay. I like this guy. You have your... He's got pretty lousy jokes that are funny as hell, and he gives me water. What more can he ask for? Okay, so restore crippled part, uh, body part. Does that take a doctor's bag? None of your limbs are crippled. Oh, right, because they have to be complete, uh, completely broken. So we just need to heal, and that should take care of the whole kit and caboodle for us. Uses Using one stim pack. Well, actually, it didn't completely fix the head. But another time should do it. So that's we'll do it for two stim packs. Still cheaper than going to Doc Church, man, that's for sure. Well, actually, is it, though? What is it? What does a stim pack go for? Well, I'd have to look and see what they would sell it to me for. Because church charges anywhere from 50 to, I think, 100 to caps well, to affect you up. Hmm. I don't know. I don't remember. Can't check right now anyways because he's asleep. Or at the bar getting shit-faced. The other thing, too, about my little medical station is it... If you're really badly damaged, it takes multiple attempts to get fully healed. So if you compare the value of that with just paying Doc Church, maybe it is cheaper to use him. I don't know. We'll have to look at that later. Let's put our night vision on. I have to remember what key to press. Okay, so we are going south. Due south. Let's do it. Your weapons fire. All right, we got uh, probably raiders over here. Oh my god, there's a shit ton of them. What are they all doing? That's a pretty decent sized gang of raiders there. All right, let's just follow them and see what they do. Shooting at something. Oh, dang. Yeah, they forgot about me. Okay, we're still in danger from something. Oh, they were fighting Brotherhood. Okay. Well, whatever is happening, it's back off that way. So let's loot these bastards.
Oh, should take a look at that pistol. That could be something good. I, th I think that was an energy weapon, actually. Bullpup Assault Carbine. Not taking the metal armor. <clears throat> That's got a value of 22.9. It uses five millimeter rounds. That's only got a VW 14.4, so we'll mark those for dropping. Oh shit, I forgot to put this away. Ah, oh, damn it. Got to put that away when we were at the base. I think it's probably time to take these off. Still a little dark, but... Take that and that and that. <clears throat> uh... What the hell? Okay. Whoopsie. Okay. This is all pretty much new territory. For me is this an actual POI of some sort I think so because it looks like it has a door what is it a car dealership let's just poke our head inside of here been in here? Looks like everything's looted. No, no, I guess not. I was going to say, I don't remember coming in here. It's just a coffee maker. Generators that are still running. Okay. There's not really much in here. Oh, you know what I should have done? Damn it. I should have brought all my pre-war books. Because the Arlington Library is just right here. Didn't even think about that. All right, well, it looks like this, this freeway will lead us almost exactly where we need to go. So let's just follow the road down, except for we got some assholes to deal with here. Okay, we're still in danger. Don't know where from though. Oh, over here maybe? Yeah. One thing about this weapon though, compared to my other sniper rifle, is it has a lot more kick to it. But that's pretty realistic though.
Lever action. Nah. I need a fucking hunting rifle, man. Well, let's pick that up for a minute and look at it at least. Yeah, it's only got a VW of 9.2. Again, we'll keep it for now. We'll check it when we get to the point where we have to. Guess we can find a vendor. Go check this diner here. Dots Diner Southeast. I'll take that. Sometimes these places are booby traps, so watch out for landmines. There's a safe with nothing in it and a scout handbook. Nice. That made it worth coming in here for. I'm not going to take a conductor too damn heavy. Let's go ahead and... Uh, no. Yeah. We're at Scout Handbook. Survival. Point two. Bibliophilia. Okay. Just doing a quick scan to see if there's any bad bads out on the road there. The Yagwai out there. Let's eliminate him just in case he run into him on the way back unexpectedly. Yeah, I have a good headshot. Okay, we have a caution. I believe is a raider. More raiders way down there. Users. Users? Yowzers. Well, these guys are users too. Yet dead. When you turn up, you dead. Where'd dog meat go? Your time just ran out. Oh shit. Did she throw a grenade? Yeah, she did. I just didn't hear it blow up. That was weird. Alright, let's go loot these guys before we go into Nuka-Cola. Yeah, I wish I would have brought those books with me. Alright. Take that and that. Absinthe. All right, let's go loot these other two raiders.
Nuka Cola Factory. There's a pretty high probability that I went in here the last time I played this game, but I remember absolutely nothing about it. Nuka Cola Grape, Nuka Cola Cola. And we really only need three more quantums, and we we got the quest done anyway. But we'll take as many as we can get because they're pretty valuable. All right, let's do a quick save here just in case something goes haywire. And we could stand to get a little bit of health. Uh, no. Go to... Do I not have any food on me? Huh. That's weird. Yeah, I guess I didn't bring any food. Okay, well then... Let's just take a... We don't have an expired stim pack. Let's just take a normal stim pack. Alright, here we go. Door to the factory floor. Recover the Nuka Cola Quantum Shipping Manifest. I don't remember why I need to do that, but we will do it. I wonder if we're going to be dealing with bandits in here or ferals. That's a very hard lock. Okay, we won't be getting into there. Alright, let's go left first. Because that's what you always need to do, is go left first. Oh, shit. Looks like maybe we're dealing with bots in here. Nothing like shotgun slugs to take care of bots. And if they're really nasty, we got pulse slugs. But I found that normal slugs do pretty good against the basic bots. So we'll save the pulse ones for anything really bad, which we're probably going to run into in here. Towards the end of the place is my guess. Five, six rounds. Research terminal. Company announcement. The Nuka Cola Corporation is pleased to announce to all of its employees that the first shipments of our Nuka Cola Quantum are on their way to the re retailers in the Washington, D.C. area. This flagship test market program is the culmination of a three year research program to bring the refreshing state of Quantum to market. Congratulations to all employees on a job well done. Quantum Progress Report. Oh, you know what? I need to. I'm reading this in reverse, aren't I? Okay. Attention all Nuka Cola Corporation employees. We're very proud to announce that R&D has been completed on Nuka Cola Clear with an only minimal loss of life. <laughs> We've been able to modify the look of Nuka Cola, uh, but give it the same great taste. We will be submitting the product to marketing shortly for bottle design and advertising strategies. From all of us in the research department, thanks for the support. Right. Okay. Progress report. Isotope CE770 has proven to be a disastrous failure. All of the test subjects suffered severe internal organ failures and died within three days of ingestion. We recommend the immediate destruction of container A32 in the production rooms and suggest switching to isotope CE772. Please send standard Nuka condolences, fruit, and cheese packages to the test group members' families. <laughs> you bastards. Oh, I love it. Uh, okay, so... I bet you we're going to run into container 832 and probably find some glowing ones or something. Let's see what this one says. Isotope C772 has proven too damaging to be the initial test uh, to the initial test group, which now needs to be disbanded due to the reluctance to continue in our program. This group has suffered four fatalities, 12 major internal organ failures, and 32 internal radiation burns. This is an unacceptable number of issues in a given test group and recommend we switch to an alternate isotope, such as CE774, 
or you are 993 isotopes. Test subjects in the Nuka Cola Quantum Program are responding well to the reconfigured taste and the new isotope. The only listed side effects from the group are three cases of dizziness, one case of nausea, and one case of impaired vision. We find from a sampling of 50 that this is an acceptable number of cases and approve this product for production. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. And then we already read the announcement where it was done. Okay, cool. So I think we just need to be careful when we find container A32. Something bad's going to happen when we run into that thing. Another terminal? Oh. No, this is the same. Yeah, that's the same information. Okay. Caution. Same thing? Yeah, I think so. Uh, we don't have a key for that safe. Oh, wait, do we? No. Okay, I think I'm going to put these on. It's going to be a little bright, but overall we'll be able to see better. It'll help if I turn this light off too. Take that for sure. shit. Okay, we have a gas leak. So we got to be careful of that. A nuke alert? What the fuck? A nuke alert? Nuka lurk meat. No shit. What does it say about that? It gives a, a, a action points. Huh. Okay. Let's do a quick save before we go into the storage and mixing vats room. there. Nice. Take all of that stuff. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll grab the laser pistol for the moment. Pulse grenades, perfect. That's a very easy lock, but I hate those damn puzzles. And all it's going to do is have us unlock the bot anyway, and we don't need him. Okay. Let's go 
Go down here, dog meat. Oh, uh, seriously? God damn it. All right. Um, uh, let's take a Rad X. And I don't think I have anything else to help with radiation resistance. Reduce. Yeah, I don't think so. Okay. None of this stuff's going to help us either, so we're just going to take some radiation. Crazy in here, man. Guess we have to get over to there. They don't see me, huh? Dog meat. Let's grab their meat. Is this whole place, like, flooded with Nuka-Cola Quantum? What does that stuff look like without my... ...night vision on? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it is. <laughs> Not sure. Okay. Oh, he wants to go that way. Another one. I don't see anything up here. It's a good thing he's stuck. Another door here. Door to offices. Okay, where do those other places go, though? Um, let me look at my quest here. Yeah, that's the active quest, so it wants us to go that way. Uh, it's a question of how do we get over there. Maybe we can't get over there from here. Well, unless we do that, I suppose. Oh, there's no door over here. Damn it, Jim. There's a door here. Bomb shelter living quarters.
That sounds like a feral. No, those are still Mirenworks. Jesus, we're taking a lot of radiation down here. I just want to look down here really quick before we get out of the muck. Nuka Cola Workers Bomb Shelter. All right, let's do this. Let, Doc, mate, look out. Let's go back to this first passage. Uh, let's go left. Don't need any glowing mushrooms. Man, I wish she had some rat away. Actually, you know what? I think I do have one thing of rat away. I do. Nice. Did we miss something over here? A laser pistol. Mm. We'll pick it up for now. Handyman jumpsuit. What does that do? Does it give us radiation protection? Repair plus five. Okay. How much is it worth? Uh, not anything to speak of. So we're going to check it. Door's locked. Box of detergent. Turn that asshole off. Can't open that safe. Okay, I guess that's it for over here. Let's go check this area. Get the meat off all these guys. Hatchling Meyerlick meat. Don't uh, 
I don't remember what we do with that. Well, I, I mean, obviously we make something with it, but I'm not sure what it is. Nothing in that trunk. Okay. Can't open that door. Nothing in there. Locksmith. We'll take that. Wait, no. Cancel. I don't want to sleep. Oh, that, okay. That's not a permanent locksmith. That's a temporary. So we'll just hang on to that. If we need to get into something especially hard. I don't think we can do average yet, can we? No. Okay. Let's go through these doors. Running low on shot shoddy shells. All my ammunition is armor piercing, so should be effective on these guys. What the hell? Baby Marlurk. Right away. We need it. That door is very hard. I, I need a fucking radiation suit to be coming in here, man. This is nuts. Okay, I think we killed all those guys. There's stuff over there. Come on, get out. I'm not even gonna try and get all the meat from those guys. Um, uh, take all of those. 
Okay. I'm not seeing anything significant here. Let's just get the hell out of this room. Teleporting shit. It's not allowed. Shut up. Oh boy, we are we're in bad shape. Had I known um, this place was going to be like this, we would have brought our rad suit. But I had no idea. I mean, I guess I sh I should have figured that out. Nuka Cola, right? <laughs> Get up here. Not seeing anything significant in here. That door is very hard. I don't know what happened to dog meat. It wants us to go up that ladder. in here. Ladder to the Capital Wasteland. Did we miss something? Hmm. All right, let's go back over here. After all of that, we still haven't found any more Nuka-Cola Quantums. What the hell, man? So that's the very hard locked door. We went left. Let's go right this time. with nitrogen. <clears throat> okay, I guess that's... That's it for over here. We didn't happen to pick up a key for this did we huh well all right damn it jim why did i miss those i don't think it's a good idea to go trouncing around back down in the irradiated liquid 
without first going home healing up and getting a radiation suit. But obviously I missed something somewhere. We came through here. That was the robot. Yeah, then we get down into the muck again. Okay, well, I think what we're going to do then is go home, get fixed up, and come back. <coughs> Excuse me, come back here with um, some radiation gear because this is too intense. I mean, my health is down to like almost one third. It's too fucking dangerous, man. So I'm going to cut the camera here and I'll meet you guys back here with uh, where, where we'll be a little better equipped to do this place.